As we move toward the fifth Sunday after Pentecost, my name is Nancy Robbie, pastor of Grace Lutheran Church. And this week we get to hear the parable of the Good Samaritan, a very familiar story. Well, we are not going to be talking about all the nice things we should be doing for our neighbors, uh, by which people are often called Good Samaritans, a term that is tossed around so lightly. But instead, I would like us to ask, why are we Christian? <laughs> Why are we Christians? Not because we want to know God or to know Jesus, not necessarily a personal matter only, but more importantly, because we believe that Christ is truly the hope of the world and that his way is not only the best one, but it is the way through which the healing of creation and everything in it can occur and will occur. We believe this. All creation through him will be healed and restored. But this doesn't happen on its own. We don't just sit back, put up our heels, and wait for the good news to fall on the earth. In fact, uh, if we do that, bad things are going to happen <laughs> more and more, as is uh, the way. Healing and restoring doesn't happen on its own. Jesus needs us to be agents of that healing. And not just in a way where when we see someone who falls down uh, by the side of the road, we of course would stop and help them. That goes without saying. We are called to be radical agents of healing and restoration, going way out of the boundaries of expectations, blowing up all the, the patterns of behavior that have become customary and instead embracing the radical call to love, to unselfish love, to that love Christ calls us to that is the same love that God showers on every living thing that God, uh, God's self created. So the Good Samaritan gives us a perfect model for this if we look more deeply into this story. It's not just someone who stopped by the side of the road to help someone out, but we're going to look at all the ways that uh, every expectation of what that person's behavior might have been was shattered by his response to love as Jesus calls us to. So I hope you'll be with me in church uh, or perhaps online, but better to be in person. So please do join us this Sunday at 915. I'll be looking for you there. Peace be with you.